Welcome to my mum's basement. On this episode, I'm going to show off my Game Boy Advance Castlevania Collection. These are all CIB because, well, that's how I like to do things around here. Go and get everything that belongs to a game, and, well, who cares about the carriage? Actually, well, I do like having the cartridges, but I do have some boxes and manuals around without games. But these are not them. This is the complete set of these ones. Got Harmony of Dissonance, Circle of the Moon, and Araya of Sorrow, all complete. You can see these are really cool looking. Look at all the artwork there. That's some artwork on there. Yep. It's very artistic and very cool looking. And check this out. Baggy. Baggy for the cartridge. Awesome. Super complete. Super CIB. And what else have we got in here? In this copy of Circle of the Moon, we've God, look at that! Pamphlets and precautions booklets and all that and some more really nice artwork here. And the niceness continues on the inside. These are so swell. These are so full of swellness. They're bursting off the screen here. These are, well, <clears throat> high up in, in my collection universe. These are, well, really... You know, I'm really, really happy to have these. Circle of the Moon. There we go, Harmony of Dissonance. Some more great artwork there. Look at that. Super! Fantastic! Now, the thing about this one here is... I've actually ordered this one on eBay years and years and years ago. And I got it at a preposterously good price. And I couldn't make out why. I just thought I got lucky. I thought I was quick on the draw. Turns out, no. I bought a fake. More precautions booklets. These are super mega minty complete. These are... Look at that. Look at all that artwork. And look at that Yu-Gi-Oh! commercial on the back of the manual there. I could not be happier with these if I tried. That and a Raya of Sorrow. More swellness, more awesomeness, more fancy artwork. Is this one as complete as the rest of them? Yep. Baggy. Look at that. Super de duper. More manuals, more precautions booklets, and Araya of Sorrow has a commercial for Harmony of Dissonance on the back. A GBA masterpiece from Pocket Games. That's well said, these games are fantastic. And as soon as I got my fake Harmony of Dissonance in the mail, I knew there was something a bit weird about it. It was really glossy. The label looked kind of, you know, bubble jit printed and this sort of thing. So I was kind of rotted about that. I ended up giving that one away a while after. But now I've got genuine copies of all of these and they're super wickedly neat. So that's the three of those. And I figured. Since I've got the three of those, why stop there? Why not pick up a double pack? Which has the two of these games on it. Just for the sake of being complete here. Now this one's uh, a bit dinged up, a bit squat. But it's got, again, big fat manual with both games in it. And no baggie this time, but you know, we can't have it all. 
I may upgrade this one in the future if I can, you know, find a sensible copy at a, uh, you know, non crazy price. But even so, it's got some artwork, just like the other ones, only much smaller because they had to squeeze twice as much on there. And as far as I know, there's only one other Castlevania game on GBA, which is this one here, which is the reissue of the NES one. Part of the classic NES series. And I had to give that too. And in this case, I locked on to a sealed copy. So I'm guessing there's more artwork and precautions, booklets and stuff like that inside. So yeah, if you've made it this far, thanks for following me on part of this journey through one of the most treasured parts of my collection, Castlevania, GBA set. If there are any others, I don't know about them. Maybe there are some, you know, foreign versions that I don't have or whatnot. Maybe there are different games. I'm sure there's foreign versions of all of these, but... You know, if there's any different games, you know, feel free to comment and maybe I'll try and, you know, get even more complete about it. So, thanks for watching my mom's basement and I will see you next time.